Look at all the people waiting for me. My goodness, peeps. Woo. Elisa and Penny, Robbie, Gloria. Uh, do, 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 Kathy. What, just the four of you making all those? <laughs> and Judith, hey, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Okay, so what are we doing tonight? Um, oh, I'm going to sleep. Oh, painted lavender. Where's the dyes that go with it? Right here. I didn't label them yet. They're kind of in there. Yeah. And the paper is to die for. Even if you never get the set. There's so much you can do with this paper. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, let's see what I came up with. Oh, I got a mess here. Okay. Organize, organize. I think we got it. Kind of, sort of. I'm never organized. You know that. So here's card number one. Let's get this right. At least I can do something right, right? <laughs> so let's get these goodies out. Simple card. Oh, yeah. What else did I use? Silly me. Um, yeah. I didn't label this one either. Thoughtful Expressions which is these softly sophisticated and you can earn this for free did i use this countryside corners maybe then we've got the paper butterfly accents that come with this suite and i stuck them oh I stuck them in here because, you know, when you got, see, flew away. So I don't want them flo flying away, and I don't want my dad getting his hands on them because then they'll really fly away. All right. What else did I use? Oh, on one of the samples, I used You're In My Thoughts Today, but I'm changing it for the second card to something else. Something, something. I don't know that I used countryside. Yeah, maybe I did. Yeah, I did. I just dropped some stuff on the floor. Okay. So sincere. Happy labels. We're going to use the hello. Uh, thank you. I may know that just a note came from uh, another one. I don't know. This one? Maybe this one. Yeah, here. Just a note. But the thank you came from So Sincere. All right, now we can stamp. Let's do it. We've got to cut out the little boy, too. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. I also used, what's it called? Flight and Airy. This is also, you can earn this with the celebration. S-A-B. S-A-B. All right, let's let's cut this. It's a quickie. He doesn't even have feet. Look at her go. Look at her go. A little mishap. We'll just pretend I cut his feet off. No, I didn't. He came that way. Oops. Come on. You're doing good. Don't mess up now. Let's not cut his beak off. Turn the paper. Let's get rid of that. And that little bump on his head. Okay. I like that scissor. Okay, so we are going to take, well, I am anyway, not we. 
So I'm going to put that bump up. Up, 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 up. I'm going to take Pretty Peacock. And let's go once, twice. And I wanted that up there. All right, and thrice. Yeah, that's cool. Um, hmm. Where's a scrap? No, not that one. This will work. I just want to get a little bit up in there. Some of that's going to get covered up. Now we leave that over there so that I put my hand in it. No, I think I'm going to clean it. I should use my new little thing, but I didn't go to the sink and wet it. So we're doing it the way I always do it. Oh, look what I did. I sprayed some speckles on there. That'll work. We'll have some speckles. So this one is going to get so thankful for you. Right there. It's got speckles. It's special. All right, so we're going to line this up. I'm really not in good view. So we're going to line, <laughs> we're going to line that up. Then we're going to give that a little twist around. Oh, I got the dropsies. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I should have cut him double. I think that's what I did on the other one, but oh well. Bless you! I know I'm so nice to him. I'm going to put this little guy right there. Isn't that side pretty too? But we're doing very simple cards. This goes on the inside. Move to Houston. Who are you telling to move to Houston? You move to Florida. It's kind of looking down. I might have to restamp that. I'm not sure if I'm loving the speckles. So that's going to go right there. You probably can't see the speckles. Maybe you can. And then because I'm being simple, I'm not popping it. She's looking kind of shy, isn't she? Look how simple. And we're just going to take a couple of these. We'll go one, two. And one over there. 
So there it is. Why does it seem so dark? I have that problem sometimes. Okay. I better put that over there. Card number two. It's right there. So you don't need an inside because that's white. Put your paper in first and then cut it because this will change a little bit. Wrong side. So this is two and an eighth by three and seven eighths. And I'm going to show you how I stamp that up, up, up and away in my beautiful balloon. Whoa. All right. So we have that ready. I'm going to show you how I stamp this. Let me stamp this first. Let's do a little thank you, thank you. Ooh. And that one I did in Gorgeous Grape. And I'm telling you, I got to do something with these because look how those colors faded. And when they're up on my shelf, I cannot see where they are. I'm like looking, looking, where's the grape? Where's the Highland Heather? Can't find them because they turned blue. I don't know why. All right. So that's going to go, I feel like my camera is right in my head. Bing. Okay, we got that ready. So I don't need this again, but I do need, where to go? All right, fresh Frasia. So let's grab a scrap. I had a bunch of them out here. Here's a scrap. Here's the stamp. So, depending on what colors you want to accent, I take a marker. Uh, this one is... <laughs> How many times I turn that around? Highland Heather. And I'm going to do... Thump, 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 thump. This is the thumping method. And you just let this bounce off. Now, you can use a dauber. Um, you can also use a pencil eraser. Like on, from a new pencil, if you know what I'm saying. So it's nice and flat. You can remove ink that way too, or use your blender pen if you want to remove some ink. Oh, so now I'm using um, Gorgeous Grape. I knew that without even looking. Just to give it a little bit more. I think I'm giving this one a lot more than I did the other one. So let's see how it comes out. And then you stamp. Oh, I think it's going to be pretty. Look at that. Could have even done more. So that's how you give it all those different colors. And then you cut it out. Right, so oh, this side is so pretty too. See, this is such a great um, paper to like if you have lots of dies with you know big words on it. Like I have some of those contraband. Yes. Put a little vellum on it to soften it. 
and put the cockroach on. All right, so that's going to go there. So I may as well just glue her down. And that's about, oops, I got a little cocky there. So we've got that, and then I've got that. I was just looking at some of the comments. Um, oh, I didn't want to glue it there. Excuse, please. All right. So that's going to go there. That's going to go right there. Up a little. Then I didn't exactly like how that cut. So where's that little sharp scissor? So we're just going to do a little surgery. Dr. Stepper. It's like a little facelift. Oh, we had quite the rain before. Hi, Kathy. All right, so that's going to go there. But then, but wait, there's more. So these need a haircut also. So we're going to cut them off. Highland Heather and gorgeous grape. So we'll put one going that way, one going that way. I don't want to cover up too much of that. And then one in the middle. I got to pop out that little dot. All right, let's glue them down. Whoa. So last night, oh my goodness, last night I was doing my nails. Didn't they come out nice? So I have a little crack right there in my nail. So I said, oh, I just bought that crazy glue for my tooth that didn't work. And um, yeah, I'll just get some of that. So I went to put it on here and it just all over the glass here onto my fingers. I had to like shake off the tube. Then I, I don't know, somehow I got a piece of cardstock on there. I had to nail file the cardstock off because uh, I don't know, my um, nail polish remover was not working so well. So there I was with the nail file, like getting all this glue. The rest of it came off today when I did dishes. I was like, what the... It was a fun time, I'll tell you. That stuff just poured out of that tube. There's another little spot there. Wrong side. That's it. Wrong way, Gail. So last week at sewing, there was another woman there. <laughs> I'll see her again on Tuesday, the class. <laughs> her name was Gail. So, I, you know how I talk to myself? So I was like, damn it, Gail. <laughs> and she turned around. I said, no, no, if you hear me like saying nasty things to Gail, I'm talking to myself. So I had to like behave. So she didn't think I was talking to her. But it was pretty funny. 
All right, so just, oh, there it is. When that stuff fell before, this was one of the things. So I'm going to put a couple glue dots. And this is retired ribbon, but, like, why not? It matches. Stay. You need to turn that way. All right, don't. Go wherever you want. Then, I'm going to do that. And I don't measure like Sue. But that is a good trick. But that piece is too small to turn around. So, the one thing I am going to do, though, is take a little piece. I could use this that I cut off. We'll go that way. <laughs> and stop. I got to practice not saying my name. <laughs> so what that's going to do is just pop that up a drop. I think it needs more. I'm going to do another little piece right here. Because that's two layers. Well, so is that. Oh, but it, then it's going up one more. I got it. I'll do my math. Now. See, because if you used a dimensional, then it would be too much. Oh, I forgot something. Oh, we could still do it. Because I caught it. You know how I like to do that. It does make it like a little bit. Now I got glue on my finger. It does make a little bit of a difference. Without having to layer it. I got to put that back together right. Okay, it's even Steven. And then, I know I put them up there. I'm using up all these little ones. So, I'm going to put them right on this flower because it's nice and straight. And I'm just putting three in a row. Three ducks in a row. And there it is. And we could. All right. Be proud of me, Tony, if you're here. Let's give it a little wink. We're going to wink it right there. I didn't wink the other one. Wink, wink. We'll just do these so they're not so plain, Jane. Now, if I had done them before, it would have been easier. Oh, I like you. little sparkle never hurt anybody. Let's see if you can see it. Uh, here it is. A little wink. Okay. Next up, is this one right here. Okay, you go back right there. Don't move. Oh, another white card. Oh, and see? Oh, yeah, I did save the other one, too. Because it was, like, nice and straight. How could you not? How could you, like, throw it out? All right, so you can use these guys either way. But what I'm going to do first is 
take a little fresh Frasia. and get the outside of the wings like that. You could leave it just like that if you wanted to. Then I am going to take, let's see with the Highland Heather. I think I used um, the grape. Okay, now around here, I'm going to shape like around the body and then color in the rest. Then, I didn't do it this way, but I'm going to try it. You can take the Wink of Stella because that'll move some of the ink and then blend it. We're going to blend it with the wink. Oh, yeah. So you can see some of that. Well, maybe you won't see it. But some of this ink is moving, and it's going right up into the rest of the flutter by. And that just softens the edges here. I did it with um, a whatchamacallit. Uh, yeah, blender pen. Then... I'm going to take, ooh, I think it's over here. Yep. I'm going to take the dark basic black. Now, I did the other one lighter, but I like the black better. And just do that. Oh, it's very sparkly. So, oops, so we have her ready. Now, we're going to take this and the pretty peacock. Now, if you really wanted to, you could you know, remove some of the um, green and put like fresh Frasia or the Highland Heather or something in there. But I want it to look more grassy. And I wanted it to be a little lower. Now what? I wasn't paying attention. So I'm going to take the bottom of the stamp because, you know, you can basically kind of fix anything kind of sort of uh, you go over there then we're going to glue this oh no first oh no i'm not stamping anymore until i do the butterflies i could trim this down you know what Hmm. Already put glue on it. We'll leave it. Okay. Hmm. Uh, scrap. Scrap a dap. Okay. So I'm going to stamp hello and get that ready. H-E-L-L-O. And I want the, I know I'm so annoying. When I'm around Sue, she smacks me. So I'm going to stamp hello. And then I'm going to take the double oval. Let's 
So on a small one like this, you know, you can you can just stamp it, cut this first, punch them out. Oh, God, it got it. It's not from there. It's from my fingers. All right, so now this is ready. I know where I'm putting a gem right there. That's going to go on the... Oh, I have two. Boo-hoo, what did I do? I must have cut this down twice. I think I did. Maybe I didn't. I love this side. It's so gentle. Subtle. Hi, Miss Judy. Upside down. Eh, eh, eh. All right, so let's put this piece in there. Upside down. <laughs> I am the upside down kid. Oops. Oops, that's a lot shorter. We don't care. It's fancy. Fancy schmancy, as my grandmother would say. Okay, so now I cut out a few of these and I cut out a couple extra because I thought, well, maybe, maybe I'll see how it looks with a few more. I'm not going to see that anyway. So if I do that and I do that, and, oh, I thought I didn't have these, then do. Yeah, okay, you don't see them. Unless I bring them out a little more. Like so. My next life I want working fingers and a singing voice. Is that asking too much? I don't think so. Um, hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure. One or free? Put it in the comments. That's going to go there. This is going to go here. And then I have to stamp the two flutter buys. One. Okay. Uh, the Flutterbys, where are you? Okay, so we're going to take the Fresh Freesia, Freesia and I'm just going to stamp the big one. I'm going to take a little bit of Gorgeous Grape and do the same kind of thing. Make sure there's nothing on that other butterfly. And I'm going to stamp right there. Yes. Then I'm going to do it again carefully. You 
she did it again. <laughs> Let's give this one a little bit more bling. A little bit more around the edges. And that's going to go in that direction. Look at that. Can you see it? Okay, so I'm trying an experiment before I do it to Bob. So, you take avocados and you make yourself some guacamole or whatever else you want to do. I used four. Then you make your guacamole, put it aside. You take the pits and you cut them up into pieces and you put them in a jar. So I had four avocados. So I put all those little pieces in a jar, canning jar, or whatever, glass jar. And then you cover it with a good vodka. You want a good quality vodka, not the cheap stuff. And then every time you go past the jar, you shake it. Make sure you keep shaking it every so often then you put it on a cotton ball so i i did it once today put it on a cotton ball and put it on a spot of arthritis that really hurts so i have a spot on my foot by my like my knuckle my big toe kills me so I put it on. It's already feeling better. I mean, are you kidding me? So I'm going to do it for a couple days. And then they say that you take the avocados and <clears throat> I wish I had a green. Um, like, especially for people that, you know, eat avocados all the time. So I guess I'm going to like avocados. A little more than I ever have. He won't eat them, of course. Maybe when he finds out, it's going to help him, I hope. But anyway, you keep adding to it. And then if you have to add a little bit more alcohol, you do. Take a swig out of the bottle, pour some in, you know, whatever you want to do. Uh, am I on the right side? Yeah. So I'm going to bump this up a little too. So I'll keep you posted how it's doing, but. Um, I think my foot feels better. Might be mine. Oh, I just put it on the wrong side. Might be mind over matter, but I, I don't know. People are saying that it really, really works. Are you, are you kidding me? There. Oof. So again, I'm going to do two. Bump that up. Fingers work. That's going to go right there. Look how pretty. Simple, right? Um, yeah, I put them over there. You got this, Gail. So, I know I have to put one there. Uh, and then I'll put one there. And again, I forgot to put the glue first, but whatever. And there. So there's card number three. Now you can see on this one, yeah, this one I did definitely use the darker color. But I like that light one too. Could add some darker, like do three. Don't, don't, don't. Don't, don't. Okay. Card number four. We're switching colors.
Oh, maybe that's where that other piece. Yeah, yo. So let's do the inside. Vodka is very healthy because you get your vitamin C in the orange juice. Right. Calcium, very, very good for you. I'll take it. Oh, let's put this in. Because we can. Look at that. It's not even... Upside down this time. Oops, slide up a little. No, slide up. There we go. Yeah, ooh, like an inchworm. Oh, oh, no, we don't want the bump. Whew. Bump avoided. <laughs> All right. Let's put this together. So this is my normal three and three quarters by five. Then oh yeah, you can cut that piece we're gonna use out from there because that's gonna get covered. But I'm not doing anything with that yet. We're going to do this. So now I have to remember what I did. Oh, yes, I remember. Okay. So I took, I took colors that I really didn't love. So we're going to try something a little different, I think. Uh... Because it turned too green. I should have washed this. We'll just use the corner right there. So this is the Tahitian Tide. And the bottom is going to be, so I don't want like too much of it. And I don't care if I get it on the body because I'm going to paint that. That might look good. Just those two. All right, we'll see. I don't want to do, do I want to do purple? Just want to do it a little different. And the other one. All right, we could try this, but then it might be too much. We'll see. I really should have washed this. Oh, oh yes. Oh yes. Not too much, just enough. Oh yes. Okay. I think I like it. I think I like it. Do, 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 do. All right, move that aside. Now, we're going to take, oh yeah, we got to color that. Easy peasy. Now, put a little glue on it. Oh, hiccup. I want a 
little too far on that. Oh, wavy, wavy. I really like this scissor. Somebody gave this to me as a gift years ago. Like it was in a Christmas exchange. And those packages went flip it, flip it, flip it around. So I don't even remember who, who it came from. But dang, it's a Martha Stewart. Taiwan. Dang, it's a nice scissor. Oops. I think my other scissors are just dull. Is what it is. All right. Now for the antennae. Very, very careful that you don't cut off the antennae. I would love that to be rounded, but we're just going to ignore that. I guess I could do that. I'll just cut off that little bit. I'm sorry, little butterfly. All right, so that's what it's going to look like. It's purdy. It's purdy. That's what the other one was. More in greens. Okay. So we just have to take that flower stamp again. And oh, I can get rid of this. So I wanted one a little, that's going to get covered. That's basically, all right. So I want one about there. So it comes up a little higher. Hmm. Now, just an idea for backgrounds, just an idea. If you have the glass mat, there's things you can do on here. Okay. So now, we're going to glue this. Whoa. Let's put this on there first. I didn't lose too much stuff tonight, did I? Thanks, Dad. <laughs> oh, what a dork. That's going to go to the left there. Give it a little eye job from top to bottom. Now we're going to, oh, that one needs a haircut too. So we're going to take this and stamp just a note. Pull it 
webcam because I can't see. Just a note. It's a little cockeyed. Now, <clears throat> we have that middle piece, but that's way too big. So. We're going to glue it. Again, I got a mark. And then, because rather than use, you know, if you don't have another scrap, Oops. And you could do this with your cutter. And then I'm just going to snip the edges. Not so evenly. Look at that almost perfect. So that'll go over there, but first we're going to do that. We're going to put this down. That We're going to put this down. Oh, I should have given it a haircut. Oh, well. A little trim. Now, we're going to do... I really don't have to do too much. Yeah, I do. I'm just going to take this piece of paper here. Fold it in half. So I have the two layers. Bam. So that's going to go right there. And that's going to get a little pretty thing right there. Um, and then, oh, I like it. I like it. Oh, all oh, right. Duh. We're going to pop those wings up a little bit. Almost forgot. And don't forget the antennae. Oh. Right there. Just hold it for a couple secs. No, no, no. They're not having sex. So let's put one, well, we, I lost it. We know we want to put one right there on that spot. <laughs> so we got to kind of even them out. So we'll put one there. Yeah, that'll work. We'll put one there. One there. And one over there. One over here. One over there, maybe over there. And that's that. I like how that one came out. I do. 
So there's different ways to color things. So there are, look at that, they all fit. Don't even have to raise my camera. Something must have happened here. So there they are. I think, I think next week um, will be Paper Pumpkin. And that uses all this stuff. So I'll be mixing things up. Yeah, I think mine is coming on, um, on Wednesday. Paper pumpkin. You were thinking about drinking the vodka, but I don't drink. Yeah, but how unhealthy could it be? It's got avocado in it. I mean, seriously. Right? I mean, avocados are supposed to be really, really healthy. Just adding a little vodka. Maybe it takes the alcohol out of it. <laughs> I don't know. I'll let I'll let you know. <laughs> But in the meantime, I'm going to keep rubbing it on my foot and, and right here. And um, if it works, I'll, it's going to be all over Bob's back. Yep, it will be. So I'm giving it a week of using it. I'm going to finish eating my uh, guacamole. And then um, I have to buy more avocados and keep adding to it. So, yeah. So thanks, everybody, for joining me. And I will see you next Sunday. Have a great week. Good night, everybody.